Let's -a go. Oh. There we go. There we go. It's that's gonna be your thing now, isn't it? That's the thing. That's your thing. That's how we do it. Oh, oh, fuck's sake. Uh, episode well, six. Episode six. We're here again. We are here. Jared is here, and so is Tom. Tom is always here. It's true. I never leave. Um, what does the number six mean to you? Well, it's always been a big part of my life. Okay, shut up now. Uh, what film are we doing today? Um, Nobody wants to hear about your life. Spin that big bitch ass wheel. Of the big bitch ass wheel that some people, that some people have said doesn't exist. exist. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you've had that as well. Yeah, people keep telling me I've doesn't had some exist, of that. and I've said they want they, picture proof. Uh, I tell them you should just believe yeah. me. Well, no, here, just, just have a look. Here it is. Oh wait, it's a podcast. Oh, you can't oh, even. You look. can't see it. Oh, right, I'm spinning wheel. The wheel is spinning. Wheel is spinning. What do you think it's going to land on? Oh, I, you know, Wrong. It's Pirates of the Caribbean. Fuck. That was fast, man. <laughs> it's a fast wheel. Yeah, that, yeah you upped it. It no, seems. upped the speed upped of it. The speed Pirates of it. Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah, I'm, I'm great ready. franchise. It was. Yeah, it was. Rocky franchise. No, yeah. Sylvester Stallone wasn't in this one. <sighs> you did it. You did it. I think you did the most. We got him, boys. <laughs> <laughs> we got him, boys. We got him. Uh, your, what's your view on Pirates of the Caribbean? Did you enjoy the first one? The first one was good. Did you enjoy the second one? The second one was also quite good. The third? Third one dwindled. Okay, fourth. Fourth dwindled. No, harder, harder dwindled. Okay. And more. how many are there? I don't know how long this is going to go on. I think you just keep going. Okay. <laughs> the eighth? Oh. One of them had Javier Bardem in. I don't think I saw that one. Uh, I did. And was it? Uh, it was good. It was, oh. yeah, really big, big stunts that made no sense. Oh, of course. But why not? It's like one of the highest grossing films of all time. Let's just chuck everything at it. Yeah, it was... I, I don't really know. It was, it was fine. I mean, the first one was exceptional. The first like, one was exceptional. You can watch it now and still be like, yeah. fuck, this is a good film. Yeah. And now Johnny Depp is just Jack Sparrow for, for the rest of his life. Yeah, it's like, um, I've never... Uh, you know, you hear about actors method acting and taking some of their parts with them. Yeah. I didn't think he method acted. Did. No, you just think that's no, I think that's raw, that unfiltered. I think like I know. Oh, I think he like loved the character so much. He was like, "I'm just gonna do this end," and then. Oh, is that what he's like? That's what he sounds like. Yeah, yeah. I feel like that was more of the other one. Who's the other one? Don't know. Who else is in it? Uh, that doesn't sound like Kira Knightley. Kira Knightley, that's the one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she's got a raspy oh, voice. I love you, Orlando Bloom. <laughs> Fuck it, I love working with Johnny Depp. <laughs> Oh, I, love chips. <laughs> I know I love a fishing chips. Oh, I love a big night. boat. <laughs> oh, you said ships, not chips. Yeah. Oh, I ran with that. I know you do. I, I, I bet where? Kieran Knightley does love a good fry up though. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Probably, yeah. Oh, I bet oh. she chows down on it. What? <laughs> okay. She likes the beans. Does she? Right, so let's just do what we did with James Bond then. Let's just treat it as a franchise and see what we could do with it. Okay, off the bat. Oh, I'm gonna. This is, uh, this is off the bat. Someone said I always panic me. when you do this. Someone said this to me the other day, I'm and I worried. thought I have missed out. Jack Sparrow, Danny DeVito. Danny DeVito is perfect. <laughs> he loves rum. He loves ham. Rum ham. He's been in a boat. It's perfect. <laughs> there we go. Danny DeVito is no. I want to be pure. <laughs> Who was that? That was Danny DeVito. Was it? Yeah, it was. Is he here with us tonight? He is. He's hiding. Please now. welcome our first guest, Rebel Wilson. No. Danny D. Wilson. Danny D. Wilson. They could be related. I don't think so. Opinion poll. Yeah. Uh, in the comments below, yeah. let us know if you think that Danny DeVito... There are DeVito... no comments. This is Spotify. Cough once if you think Danny DeVito is related to Rebel Wilson. But don't cough, cough twice if you think Stalin was the one and only leader of the communist regime. Keep coughing if you're on a train. Ah, very nice. Because of that virus thing that's going around. What? Johnny Depp. Who should play Johnny Depp? Who should... Well, no, not Johnny Depp. We should play Captain Jack Sparrow. <gasps> maybe. Never mind. What were you going to say? So I was going to say maybe Captain Jack Sparrow is the actor and Johnny Depp is the role. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. mm, wow. Mm. So you're going to get. So we need to get Johnny Depp to play Jack Sparrow playing Johnny Depp. Oh, no, not at all. That's too confusing. But that's what you suggested. Do you really want to veto with Johnny Depp? No. As Jack Sparrow? Really good. No, no. I think uh, we could. Who can we get? Oh, we need, like, a spicy young male actor. Spicy young male actor. Yeah. Not many of those. No, so, someone with a bit of, you know, a bit of edge, a bit of... Chutzpah. A bit of chutzpah about them, a bit of zing, you know. And or pizzazz, yeah. Ezra? He, we cast him last week. 
Did we? Yeah. Oh, we did, didn't we? Yeah. No, we cast Timothy Chalamet. Man. No, we also cast Ezra Miller as a bad guy. Oh, damn it. Oh. Oh. T you I'd like to see? He's, oh, he's a really clean cut actor, but it might be interesting. Okay. I don't know if I want to do this. Mars Teller from Whiplash. <sighs> No, yeah, no, no. Too... he doesn't have the charisma. No, I know, but can Jack you force him into that? It's got to be someone that's like. It's got to be someone already there, hasn't it? Balls his out. Someone that's already like just does not give. Liam Hemsworth. Good. Liam Hemsworth. The, the worst of the Hemsworths. Missed out on Thor though. He's probably got some some grudge match. I bet he's really brother. Thor about that. Man, you're laughing so hard. It's not even been picked up by the mic. It was crazy. Oh, he's crying now as well. That was a good joke, wasn't it? Fuck you, just laugh! <laughs> okay. Um, uh, I don't know, I'm still not sold on it. No? Seth I... Rogen. No. A jolly pirate. I can't picture that. No? Hmm. This is difficult. Maybe we should come back to Jack Sparrow. It's quite a role to fit. Yeah. Let's go. Oh, oh. I've got it. Oh, I've okay. Let's cast it like it's an early 90s movie. So we can, we'll turn, for the first time ever, we'll turn back the clocks on okay. all our actors. Okay. And Who does we, Hugh Grant play, is what I want to know. Uh, he plays the... Um, oh, the British the ambassador. British, yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. ambassador guy. Him. Yes. That's, uh, that's a good one. James I Norrington. Want, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, I like that. Um, oh, hang on, wait, sorry. Split this quickly. I know who would play it in modern day, though, who do pretty good one Norman Reedus oh my oh he but really would he would be very good he'd be great but we're not doing that now no we're going back early 90s to the early 90s I want Christian Slater in this movie uh, you're going to have to remind he's me he's from who, uh, uh, True Slater Romance is. and he's pretty good is he he's, now he's quite big in the early 90s yeah, oh so my now. god yeah, I know the guy he's pretty big now actually he's been in some recent you know stuff what? Now. I, I think he'd be better in Orlando Bloom yeah that's what I was thinking yeah yeah, that's that's a good shout. Okay, Christian Slater. Christian Slater is Orlando Bloom in is Pirates of the Caribbean. The jawline in this film. He is the jawline in this film. Well, well look actually, at that. Look at that well, jawline. we don't know who we're going to cast Kira Knightley yet. Cut paper with that shit. Because Kira Knightley could cut the thing that's cutting paper with her jawline. True. I don't know why I wanted Selma Hayek. Can we just? Oh, you know, what would be a great thing for this movie. Go on. Everyone has killer jawlines. <laughs> every oh, actor. Is that how we're casting? Every actor. Okay. Okay. Every actor has to have a killer okay. jawline. Look up Selma Selma Hayek's jawline. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a oh, I see. Oh, look, it comes up. That is a... I've, I've searched it before plenty of <laughs> times. <laughs> um, I want to know. Okay, so I'm like, yeah, I mean, yeah. that's a pretty killer jawline. Yeah. That's okay. a pretty killer. Oh, jawline. so her in Kira Knightley's role? Yeah. Was she not in one of the Pirates of the Caribbean films? Um, one of the later ones? Maybe. maybe Everyone's not. been in those films, I think. Mm. Best jawlines in Hollywood. Hollywood. That was he genuinely typed that just I did. now. I did. I did. Oh. oh. No. Robert Pattinson. No, no, no. Oh, we've already got him. Um, Matt Bomer. Matt Bomer. I love Matt Bomer. He's a great actor. Who would he play though? Matt Bomer. He could play. Um, who's the guy that Kieran Knightley was supposed to get engaged to? Yeah, 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 yeah. The um, is that, that's not Norrington, is it? Yeah, yeah, it was. Oh, that is Norrington. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you know, I like that. So he's the British. Um... This this is a shout out for Tony. I know who we're casting as. Norrington's senior. Okay. Um, what's oh, his fucking name? I don't know. I forgot his this name. is all on you. Alfred in Dark Knight. Michael Caine. Michael Caine. Yeah, as as he's uh, the guy that's the senior. He doesn't have a jawline though. He doesn't have a good jawline. I yeah, mean, it's a good he's, choice. He's not, but... but he's not. He's not really in it though. Well, every oh. act, you can't have all young actors. This guy's got to be old. No, yeah, he's got to be old, but he's got to be old with. And Michael Caine's been old forever. Early nineties. John Hurt. Look, look, I really, I don't, okay, fine. John Hurt is a pretty good choice because he's great. Oh, I just had the best idea Gone. for another role. I don't know where Gone. we're going to place him, but he has the jawline. Okay, who? Dolph Lundgren. <laughs> you know that, that, you know that jawline. I know it's the that jawline. It is the first thing you see. But just he, looming over He could be Barbosa. Yes. Dolph Lundgren as the angry German Barbosa. <laughs> I love it. I, yeah, I, I think that works. It. What is the sort of, uh, are we, are we changing the plot at all? Like we haven't chosen a genre for this because it's such a big, um, yeah, such a big franchise. Like we should come up with our own plot. Okay, Obviously, Curse of the Black Pearl is the most famous one. Yeah, so uh, they need to find a boat because um, they've been uh, 
told that they can't be on a boat so yeah. they need to find their big boat again and then they go out searching for their boat and they can't find their boat what about they're on a boat right right but they're fleeing from port authorities you know like uh ice basically they're fleeing from ice they're fleeing from ice what is this still, is it still same, need, oh wait it's still same, same, from, same time period yeah they're going from Ice port exists. Port. I, I didn't realize yeah, ice was yeah. one of the oldest industry. Uh, on the oldest yeah, yeah, companies. the immigration control. They were. Anyway, <laughs> they're going from port to port, trying to trying to forge papers so that by the time ice catch up, they can be like, "Look, we're illegal. We're legal. We're fine." Right. Yep. Okay. Yeah. And where does Pirates of the Caribbean chased by ice? There's got to be something cleverer than that. Um, Pirates of the Caribbean. Ice capades. Oh, that is <laughs> so bad. I like it. Like, honestly, one of the worst things you've ever said. Oh, yeah. But that's great. Thanks. Pirates of the Caribbean, ice capades. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck me. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah we're going with this. We've got Salma Hayek playing the uh, the pirate-loving Kira Knightley role. Yes. Uh, we've got Christian Slater as Orlando Bloom. Like it. I can't remember his name in the film. Um, Jack? No, the other one's Jack. No, they're both, everyone's called Jack. <laughs> Honestly, when I was trying to think of the person she played as well, I was thinking Will Jack. Turner. Bill Turner. Oh, no, Will you? Turner. Bill Turner was his dad. Yeah, but Will Bill. Will it Bill? Uh, Next week's episode, Will it Bill? Bootstrap Bill. Bootstrap Bill, yes. Bootstrap with the, Bill. With the limpets on his face. Bootstrap Bill Turner. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's pretty good. Uh, Thank you. Barbosa. Yeah. Oh, yeah, thanks. Because that's who it was. I know. I, I got that. Geoff, Jeffrey Rush. Yeah. Um, okay. We yeah. The is old that, guy is that curled off R at the end. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Exactly. All right. We've got to have the goofy bad guys. You know those two skeletons, uh, Mackenzie Crook. Oh, they're such good casting and though. They really were. I who, don't. Who's know. the other one? Who's the equivalent? Of, yeah, but who? Who's equivalent of them? Yeah, and has good jawlines. Back oh, in the yeah. <laughs> yeah. We need good jawlines. I forgot about this. Um, oh. Ooh. I can't believe I'm about to do this actually because oh, I can't a believe it's not actor. He's a pretty good actor to save. To be honest, no, I'm going to save it. No, okay. Saving him. Who's the guy from the X Files? David Duchovny. David Duchovny. Yes, yes, David Duchovny. <laughs> Cast Absolutely. David Duchovny. And Brad Pitt. We can get uh, Don Cheadle in on this. Don Cheadle. Okay, I like this. Don Cheadle can be in on it. I don't know who he could be because we need Don a kind of pirate crew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can have um, Don Cheadle, David Duchovny, the the Pitts. I think Angelina Jolie is a good a good choice. Yeah, so what she would she be like um Yeah, what's her name? Um Gamora's role, because Gamora's in this film. I don't oh. know if you knew that actually. Gamora's in the film. Yeah, she is. I can't remember her name. I'm thinking of um <sighs> Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm thinking oh, of. Whoopi Goldberg could be Apocalypto. Whoopi Goldberg, yeah. Yeah, yeah, of course. Whoopi Goldberg, yeah, Whoopi Goldberg would be Apocalypto. Okay, Easy. Perfect. So we've got the jawlines. We've got the plot. And we've got Whoopi. We've got Whoopi and Duchovny. Is there anything else needed? <laughs> There's nothing we really need from that. Duchovny and Whoopi. We did it. We did it. Yes. Pirates of the, Pirates of, Pirates of the Caribbean did it. 8 uh, Ice Capades. Nice, man. Oh, God. One of them. Doesn't it just warm your heart? Breast ideas. Yeah. <laughs> um... Let's go on to another film. Um, let's spin the wheel. I'll spin the wheel. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. It's a heavy wheel. Um, oh, it landed on Jurais, Jurassic, 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 Triassic Park. Triassic Park. Land on Cretaceous Park. Park. Nice. Cretaceous period Park. No. <laughs> um, nice. Another absolute. Classic franchise. Oh, yeah, that's what I was that they've, say. they've remade recently. Not remade, sorry. They've just added to it, haven't they? With yeah, yeah. Did you watch any of the new ones? I did. I saw the first of the new ones. How were they? Uh, I quite like Chris Pratt in it. He's good. He's just, yeah, he's he's everything Brendan Fraser could have been. <laughs> oh, my God, you're right. You're right. He really is. He's really, yeah. He's I'm so Fraser, but he stuck with it. I'm so disappointed that Brendan Fraser isn't. Uh, Nathan Star Drake Lord. in Uncharted. Yeah, but then again, he played that in the Mummy, didn't he? Yeah, but and National Treasure or I whatever was, there are. Fucking no, that was that in. was fuck. Wait, we didn't fucking cast Nick Cage in anything yet. <gasps> well, Jurassic Park. We need we right, need the so jazz the musician. That, yeah, of, we need a of gold the film blue. industry. 
We need a Sam Neill. We need um, Attenborough's brother, Richard Attenborough, the old guy that finds Rip. Rip Rip all of them. Oh no, David's still alive. (laughs) Alive. It's all right. We'll repurpose this. Uh, <laughs> repurpose this audio. David. <laughs> I can't. I can't be asked to say this again. So, cool. whenever David dies, we we'll just we'll s- take that snippet. Yeah, nice man. That makes you yeah, really heartfelt. Good. You know. Yeah. Thanks for doing voices and stuff. Yeah, that's what he did. I thought you were going to start singing a Fallout Boy song. Like, Thanks for the memories. Oh, you know, nice. Even though they weren't so great. Huh? They were great. I've never heard the song. I can't believe you'd say that. I'm joking. Yeah. Let's go. Um, who else is in it? Laura Dern. Laura Dern. Laura Dern. Samuel Jackson's in it. Samuel L. Jackson. Yeah, he plays. Uh, I don't really remember him in the it. The fat guy's friend, in, or not his friend? He didn't like him. Oh, the guy that was he was trying to do the deal with him to get that. Yeah, yeah. He plays the guy mosquito that works juice. with him. Yeah, mosquito juice. I think mosquito. that's what he was labelled as. Wayne Knight. Okay, that's that's quite a few big roles we need to fill. Then should we start with the obvious? Should we go yeah. with Jeff Goldblum? We've got to go with Jeff Goldblum. But... We need a, a Mr. Malcolm. We need the the guide, not guide. Sorry, he's the um, he's like a what he reporter does. or something, isn't he? I'm not sure. I'm not really sure what he does, but he's, he's great. Just there. He's along for the right. He wears the shades. I'm willing to cast Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> I'm willing to cast Jeff Goldblum. Uh, if anything, he should play every role if we're going to do that. Yeah, that's true. I, I, as a side note, he's got an album out. Oh, of jazz music. I got does. it on vinyl. It's very good. Nice. Yeah. He's also got a series out on Disney. The World According to Goldblum. Oh, man. I haven't seen good. that. It's and, good. Oh, fuck. Yeah, it's good. Um, no, I, I don't think we can. I don't think we can. It goes against the whole purpose of the podcast, really. Um, yeah, well, yeah. Actually, that's the one okay. thing we get to do. So, I need someone that can wear the shades, make, you know... And an elongated laugh that can laugh off the camera. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that camera. That's so that good. Laugh. That laugh. It, was, it wasn't that. Jimmy Carr. You could pull up with that laugh. No. We can't. We can't cast Jimmy Carr. No. Um, or, but that's not a bad shout. Casting a comedian like James A. Caster. <laughs> well, as, as as our Jeff Goldblum. Yeah, that could be hilariously sarcastic. Yeah, James A. Caster. Okay, his debut role is going to be in Jurassic Park. That's one way to break the ice, isn't it? Like, well, the other option is fucking Simon Pegg. You and Simon Pegg. Why don't you I just like, like, already? No, I don't like. I don't like Why him all that much. Just... He's fine. But... God damn. He's like Hollywood's Simon answer Pig. to comedy. What's Simon Pick? Yeah. Yeah, he's good though. He is no, he's very, very clever. In the stuff that he does, like makes and creates, it's very, very clever. But like for yeah. the Star Trek, it's like we'll, just, we'll plug Simon Pegg in here. Oh, we need comedic oh, we'll get him in on. I think he weeks would be his way because he's such a super fan. He was like, now I have a name for myself. Oh, I'm yeah. gonna get myself in on this. Oh, like maybe, he did with yeah. Star Wars. No, yeah, Does he know Star Wars as well? I don't know. I think he Oh, he played a star- stormtrooper. Stormtrooper, yeah. Didn't Got Prince a- Harry supposedly did that as well. I think there were quite a few. Uh, Daniel Craig was yeah. on as well. Oh, okay. So new idea then. We get someone famous to play one of the dinosaurs, but we don't credit them. <laughs> okay, all right. So who would who's going to be in a raptor suit? Wait, you are actually in a raptor suit, not in a raptor just, suit. Okay. No, not, yeah, we're not talking like CGI post shit here. We're putting this person in a raptor suit. Okay, all right. So Rebel Wilson, correct. <laughs> Jesus, that was, that was good. Oh, that wrong. really fucking got me. I wasn't ready for that. I thought, <laughs> really? uh, in my head, I was like, he's not going to say Rebel Wilson. No. He never says Rebel no, Wilson. You're, no, you're normally the one. I'm that normally the one that says, yeah. I'm I'm going with that. Okay, Rebel Wilson. She and actually Rebel. gets the role this time. Yeah, well, first time. Well done, Rebel. She is our Big Rebel. leagues. Big leagues now, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Say goodbye Uncredited. to the perfect group. <laughs> yeah. Anna Kendrick can fuck off. Yeah, you I'm got, a raptor now. You're a raptor. Uncredited. Yeah. Oh, you know, she was still trying to tell jokes, aren't she? Oh. Hey, what about this line? <laughs> <laughs> no, we don't need improv from the raptor. <laughs> oh, and like, so, do you want me to... What's my backstory? It'd be really funny if I fall over here. <laughs> it won't, Rebel. <laughs> Rebel, we will cut you from the film. <laughs> We're well, doing this as a favour because you really <laughs> asked. Graham Norton just loves you so much. He can't get in on this. Um, okay, we have James A. Caster playing the goblin role which i i like yeah i like that i like that uh sam neil so who is the paleontologist guide he's got to wear a neckerchief too uh, <laughs> that was odd notes but fine <laughs> he has to wear that red <laughs> neckerchief oh gosh okay um, um I, I you know who i want go on i'm not sure oh this no, is no no i do I, I do brilliant i want i want him no, fuck off, because I was him I was thinking him. That's the guy I said that I didn't wanna I didn't wanna use yet. 
Bruce I was holding Willis. off Bruce Willis. That was the guy I was holding off. Fine, yeah, Bruce, Bruce Willis. Because I was actually thinking it. That's great. That's that's so great. That is great. Bruce Willis is our paleontologist. Amazing. I can't oh, believe I can't believe you thought of that. Takes a thousand mile stare as well. Yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, he does. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck, man. That was so good. That's good. Sorry, that really caught me off guard. I didn't expect him to come up with Bruce Willis. So he, who's the wingman? Who's the Laura Dern in this situation? The um the female paleontologist that's working with Bruce Willis. Um, oh, I just thought of an absolutely fucking great cast. Sorry, I'm going to cast someone else in this as Samuel Jackson's role. Oh, okay, uh, okay. I think we should cast. Um. Oh, Jodie Foster. Fuck, man, that's so sick. Yeah, that's Jody great. Foster, Bruce nice Willis. one, Jodie Foster, Bruce Willis. Yeah, really good. I'm casting Gambino. Oh, Glover. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. As Samuel Jackson's character. Okay. Because okay. we haven't done, I don't know how we managed to overlook Donald Glover in six episodes. But oh God, he's perfect, isn't it? He's so good. Yeah. Um, At- the f- Atlanta. People need to go and watch Atlanta. Uh, I haven't seen it yet. My God, it's, it's I good. know it's meant to be amazing. I, it's it's good. I recently saw it described as if GTA was a TV series. No way, really. And that kind of is, but it's even more artistic. Like oh, each okay. episode, the um, the director on it is visionary. He is. I think. So I good. think that's Donald Glover, isn't it? No, no, no. I mean, oh, he, he, he probably. Wrote it. Yeah, no, he writes and I think produces it, but the director is the guy that I think he used for a couple of his music videos. Oh, okay, all right, fair enough. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, he's, yeah, yeah. he's good then. Yeah, yeah, really good. Music videos, great. Um, who else do we need? Right, we need we need Wayne Knight, who's Dennis Ner- Nedry, Nedry, the guy that betrays oh, everyone. Yes, the fat guy with the shaving foam. The fat guy with the shaving with foam. the mosquito jizz in a jar. Yeah, that's the one. So, who is trying to sell Donald Glover mosquito spew? No. No, no, no. It's oh, Donald Glover just works. Donald Glover just works with the fat guy that's being sold mosquito spew. No, 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 no. He smuggles it out. Nedry. Yeah, Wayne Nedry. Knight, he, he smuggles it out of the out of the space and he tries to sell it on, doesn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, yeah, you're right. Yeah. And then he dies. Spoiler but, alert, if you haven't seen Jurassic Bucking Park. <laughs> sort your life out. Yeah. Oh, um, actually, we do yeah. Someone else said that to me the other day that we need to be careful of spoilers, and I hadn't thought of that because we do just fucking ruin. Okay, films. we will do, but I think we need like a, a time on on the spoilers though. If the film is older than ten years old, yeah, I think we're, we could, we should be we allowed to ruin. I think we nearly ruined the film the other day. Oh, it was um uh, the island one, Shutter Island. We didn't do Shutter Island. No, no, no. But I, I'm sure we mentioned it, didn't we? Oh we shit! It. No, no. It was a film that it was like it the was main like content. It was like. Someone Titanic or something. I, was yeah. like, I don't know what happens. Film, like <laughs> I don't know what happens in Titanic. <laughs> like Fight Club, because that's older than ten years. But yeah. I won't ruin that for anyone. Yeah. Well, I, you're not allowed to even be talking about this. I think we're going to demonetize now. Oh shit. Oh well. Yeah. Wait. Anyway. We were monetized. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Where's all this money going? Um, um. Okay. So we need it. We need to cast a Wayne Knight. Yes. Uh, I don't. I don't want to do it. I don't know why he came into my head. I don't. Oh, I'm not what James have you Corden. Done? Not no, James not Corden. James Corden. Is he in the cat suit? <laughs> <laughs> just for no, no apparent reason. Yeah, he's just no one mentions it. it I can't stand that guy. Uh, I don't. Th- fucking I annoying. Think as soon as he went to America, Brits were kind of sick of him. I don't yeah. know why. Maybe that's just like a. We were like, oh, he's defected. Fuck him. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I didn't. I don't think I liked him that much when he was here either. No. Maybe he's better. Gone. Yeah. Uh, well, I still have to fucking hear about him. Yeah, we do. Um, Although some some Brits made it big. Out. John Oliver like did a fucking good job. Yeah, and people John love Oliver's it. Good, rightly so. Ricky yeah. Gervais, huge Ricky America. Gervais. Yeah, he is great. Ricky Gervais as Wayne Knight. Would he do it? Sure, he doesn't have an option. We're, True, we're doing it. We're not yeah, putting out feelers here. We are. I casting feel like he's shit. the one guy that could step away and be. I'm not doing that. I feel like he might do it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I like that casting. So one of uh, one of the other big important roles is the guy that owns the park, played by Richard Attenborough. We need someone ethereal. Yeah, we do. Old, wise. Tilda Swinton. Tilda Swinton. You know, Joking, I, I cast her every week. Oh, I know, but she she deserves it. She does. She's so great. Um, an old, wise actor or actress, which is still actor. Get with the times. Sorry. It really took me by surprise when that happened because I wasn't ready for it. What? It just makes sense to call everyone actors. Yeah, everyone yeah. actors. Yeah, but it really hurts me every time I slip up. Now I'm like, shit! I feel genuinely bad. Like, yeah, yeah. 
I'm a product of my time. I'm an old man now. Is this about to become like a full-fledged monologue? Yes. I'd like the role, please. Please continue to listen for the next 54 minutes as Jared talks about his innermost feelings. I have none. <laughs> this is just I, a have none. <laughs> I have none! None! I have nothing! <laughs> Abandoned my boy! <laughs> oh. 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 Oh, you might have stumbled onto something here. Daniel Day-Lewis? Daniel Day-Lewis. <laughs> yeah, but he can't be cast in fucking Jurassic Park. Yeah, but if we tell him, right, you're an 80-year-old park owner. Oh, shit. As the park... Yeah. He's the method. He would. He would be an 80-year-old park He'd owner. He'd go hard. Man, if you told him to be the Brontosaurus, he would be it. Yeah, it's true. There's nothing a man couldn't he do. live as a Brontosaurus. Are we really going to cast Daniel Day-Lewis as this? I think, well, unless you've got something better. No, I think it's done. <laughs> it's done. <laughs> I think it's done. He's in writing already. I think it's done. Are we forgetting anyone? Um. Oh, you know what we didn't do? The we children. Didn't... We need to cast the children. Forgot about the children. But although they weren't even that famous anyway. Uh, do oh, you know any we're about to, oh, we're sure. about to, we're I'm about to, spinning the wheel of Oh, genres. by the way, we're about to change up the genre okay. to exactly the same genre. Oh, it's an adventure film. That's a movie. That's good. That's good. That's relative. Way. So, in terms of the plot, I reckon. Everything stays the same. Yeah, pretty much. Dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. That's it. Dinosaurs shouldn't be alive. No, alive. I want to actually shift the. Uh, let's just shift the period. It's oh, just okay. really boring. Like, oh, look, we found amoebas. Oh, That's great. So good. Yeah. We've created a single cell organism park. <laughs> <laughs> look at all these single cells. Wow, look at this one interacting just on its own. <laughs> Photosynthesis. Isn't it great? <laughs> Shit idea. Uh, cheers, man. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the children. I don't know any. Child actors. No, because no, the nineties were full of famous child actors. Now yeah. it's like no, there are no. What children. if we um, like casted some old ones? <laughs> the, 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 very confusing. Yeah. I didn't know what I was going. I didn't really didn't know. What if we were to um, uh, like, what? Yeah. Yeah. You know, make a child. <laughs> make a child actor. Well, that's what they do, isn't it? Their parents are like. Let's make. Oh no, he actor. really enjoys it. He loves to learn. Oh, words. oh, he can't get the money until he's eighteen. Oh, oh, oh. But what if we spend it all first? Come in, Macaulay. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, do another Home Alone film. <laughs> we need to buy a new car. Slap your face and scream. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we do some of the child actors we do know then. Okay. Uh, who are the sisters? Huh? The twins, Ashley. Oh, the Olsen twins, Olsen who twins. are now old enough, and one of the sisters is in. But as them, as them. Oh, were. you're casting them. Oh all. shit! One of them. No, 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 no. Avengers. No, 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 no. Kind um, of. Oh Christ! What's her name? Um, DM'd you on Snapchat, and what are you going with? This? I don't know. <laughs> um, oh, uh, what's that film? Like a like a boy, like a man. What's okay. her name? When well, she pretends to be a boy to get in the football team. Mulan. Fucking Mulan. <laughs> Ginger, Freckles, had a bit of a rough patch with heroin. Long hair. Oh, Lindsay Lohan. Lindsay Lohan as one and Shia LaBeouf as the other. Oh. Young, young bugs. Of and them. you've only gone and fucking done it. Oh. Yeah, sorted. That's yeah. it. You've That's good, it. isn't it? That's really good. That yeah. is really good. Yeah, really good. Um, and yep, stays as an adventure film. I can't really think of anything else to do with Jurassic Park. Uh, no, I do... Mm. You can't even fucking mix it up a bit, like change the. Oh, what if these dinosaurs were different? Or like, what if it wasn't a T Rex chasing them down? What would it be then? Right, a Utah Raptor. A Utah Raptor. A Utah Raptor. Did you make that up? Nope. Are you sure? I'm very sure. Okay. I know the dinosaurs. Is that because they? What were... about an Archaeopteryx? Huh? That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Oh, so oh, okay. So we're gonna go. Oh, in there. Yeah. Yeah. Why not? Any more? Uh, no, no, actually. Okay. Well, well, I don't know any more dinosaurs. I think that's a perfectly good episode. You've done it. I We've did it. Done it. No, you said I did it. You, you can't done, now you've take done credit. It. You've done it. I did it all on my you've lonesome. Done it. You did it all on your lonesome with the help of me. Yeah. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> that's you counting. Take a credit. Take a credit. Take a credit. Duh.